So I think there's several ways to think about looking at, to be an expert in your area, looking at market trends, days on market, comparables, what the market trend graphics doing. But what I'll tell you is there's also a side of the community, right? Whether you be in a, um, a subdivision, a town, a city, a suburb, whatever that may be, there's knowing what's happening. I think there's several things you can do to understand what's happening and use it to your advantage. I can tell right now if I met a, a, a realtor and I was coming to this area or even I was in the area and they would tell me about some things that I didn't know that were happening, pretty impressed. Builds rapport, helps us understand, it's a way to connect and so some of those things is number one, go explore. I love when I go overseas and travel to a different country, I always say I just want to get lost in the streets for a day. That's my number one goal is to get lost and I think so much of us take it for granted the area that we're in. I'm telling you right now, the other day I went out, I got lost and I found a cool little alleyway with some great art. I never even seen it there. And so what's that do? I tell people about it, I build rapport. It's something I never saw. And so what I tell you is, instead of going home early to watch you know, CNN or to watch you know, some show on your, your, your DVR, pump the brakes and go explore for 30, 40, 50, an hour. Go explore. Go explore the area, the town, the suburb, the, the community, whatever it is, so you are the expert, number one. Number two, I'd say, subscribe, right? Right now, I can tell right now, I live in Sacramento. I'm really involved in downtown Sacramento. Or my office is here. I live downtown. I want to know what's happening in my area. So what I do is on my, my iPhone, there's a little news app and I type in downtown Sacramento and anytime something happens in downtown Sacramento, it's feeding me the information. They have it on Android. They have it on iPhone. You can subscribe in an email as well, but it's great because I'm seeing it. So when a new restaurant opens up, guess what? I might want to go see it. My clients come in from out of town or a client that I'm showing property. Hey, let's go check out the new restaurant down the street. I just heard about it. It's brand new. It's Italian. I'm building rapport. I look like the expert. And so I think those two tactics alone are, are so powerful to help you connect with your, your clients better, to help you connect with prospective clients better, and help you to be the true expert that you should be in 2017 in this business.